there is obviously a lot of research and development to do on the biodiesel crops. I mean, it's really a, a quite a, in, in its infancy and there can be a lot of genetic development in it and all these agronomic factors are yet not yet to be determined but to be enhanced. The, probably the number one factor for this crop is it grows on marginal soils. There's a lot more marginal soils than there is highly productive soils like sandy loam and Long Bear Creek and so on. There was not a drop of fertilizer, no fertilizer applied to here, no irrigation applied, no herbicide treatment, nothing. So the, the buzzword is very low input. Low input, high yield. But this Southwest Oregon area is just prime climate for this plant. The feasibility of this crop basically is dictated, I feel, by the number that shows up on that gas pump. The higher the the higher the price at the pump, the more feasible this is. The fossil fuel guys are totally aware of this picture. They know that how much focus, time, energy is being put into the bio end of things.